Chicken Cook was set up by me in 2007 as a social enterprise and the aim of the organization is to teach people how to cook from scratch and also how to eat healthy meals uh, including you know learning about budgeting skills and also to show people it's easier and cheaper to cook your own food than buying ready meals and takeaways. Always people are hesitant, not sure, uh, always say, you know, oh, we can't cook, won't cook. And which is why the name of the organization is, is very positive. It's You Can Cook. And so that's something I wanted to bring uh, straight away. So I have seen huge changes happening uh, among individuals, especially families with kids. Uh, we tend to target kids because we know if we target kids, they can sometimes influence their family members. And so we have seen like a chain reaction happening in communities all across where we have delivered cooking projects. They love to see the raw ingredients and then the process it all goes through, the preparation, the tasting, because a lot of them taste things that they maybe wouldn't taste at home. It's easy to say to mum or dad, oh, no, I don't like that, I won't try it. But because their peers are tasting it, they'll have a go, so they, they get to taste it as well. And I think they're always very impressed with their finished product, because it looks good. It's nutritious and it's all very accessible stuff that they can get locally. So um, it's, it's been great to be involved with it and to see boys as well getting involved and, and having a go at the cooking. And then they take the recipes home and I've, I've often asked children, have you tried? Have you? And they do. They keep making them at home. They show parents how to do it, grandparents how to do it. It's been a great, it, it really is super. We made chicken stir fry. We made spaghetti bolognese, fruit kebab. Nearly every week I've taken something home. I've also shared some with my mum and dad and my grandma and granddad. And I would say their favourite one would be the curry and pancakes because they absolutely adored that one. 